Hey guys, today's how to. I'm gonna show you how to hit the double end bag. A lot of people are afraid of this bag because it's a moving target, because it responds back and forth all over the place, and so they get a little concerned about trying it out. So I wanna give you guys a few tips today, give you a little bit more ease in your way into using the double end bag. This is one of my favorite bags when I'm training boxing because it's gonna teach you a lot about hand-eye coordination, hitting a moving target, creating angles. So the goal is to work your way up to being able to hit this bag just about the same way you're gonna hit a heavy bag. So you're boxing it, you're using footwork, you're using angles, you're using all of the punch punches in your arsenal. So to get that way, you wanna start out nice and slow and nice and small. There is a timing and a rhythm to this bag, similar to the speed bag. So you wanna develop that timing and develop that rhythm. So I found that the easiest way to do that is to start on nice and close, gloves on, that's key. I wanted to make sure that, that this is a bag that we do hit with our gloves on. And so we wanna have our gloves on, we start off nice and close, and we just wanna develop a rhythm to this bag and see how it responds and bounces off the ends of our gloves, how we can throw different kinds of punches in the mix, getting uppercuts, straight punches, and just see how the bag's actually moving and responding to the way we're hitting it. As we start to get comfortable with that rhythm, then you just kind of move your weight backwards away from the bag a little bit so you can get a little more extension of your arms. That's gonna give it a little bit different rhythm, a little bit different timing to try to control it. As you get more and more comfortable with the distance that you're at, then you're gonna wanna get out fully extended. So I'm actually hitting this bag and boxing this moving target, which is similar to what would happen inside of a boxing ring. Your opponent's gonna be moving all the time, you're gonna be moving all the time, so why not hit a bag that's going to respond to what you do to it, and it's gonna completely go all over the place, so now you're having to hit a moving target. The other thing I wanted to touch on that makes this bag a little easier to hit, it will be more difficult at first, but it's something to practice as you're learning it, is you actually don't wanna stare at the bag as you're hitting it. You actually wanna use your peripheral vision as you're hitting the bag. So areas that I like to look at when I'm hitting it is like the tape area at the bottom or the tape area at the top. Sometimes I'll even not even look at all and just close my eyes as I'm hitting this bag to try and control it to get the rhythm and feel the rhythm. So these are just tips to help you guys out as you're practicing the double end bag. You come over and you wanna give it a try or when your coach pulls you off the bags and brings you over to it and has you want to try it. These are just some tips to follow that will help you get more comfortable with the double end bag. So give it a whirl, have fun with it. Let us know what other how-tos you guys want to learn. Comment, we're available to show you how to do it.